this video we can see uh, the working of an engine oil pump this is actually a type of a rotor pump you can see the internal and the external gears how it mates and that's the gear which provides the drive for the internal gear okay now let's see the components it has a driving gear and a driven gear so the driving gear is the internal gear which is marked in blue we can uh, count the number of lobes of the driving gear which is marked in blue as 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 and 6 and that particular gear is rotating in clockwise direction and the driven gear, the lobes are marked in red uh, count it as 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6 and 7 that is it has one lobe greater than uh, the driving gear that is the internal gear and we have marked the suction port in green color and the delivery port or the outlet port in red color so what's happening in the suction port is that as this driving gear rotates in the clockwise direction uh, it moves away from the driven gear at the point of the suction as a result of that a low pressure is created over there and it creates the suction and at the delivery point you can see I have marked in red color those point at that point the uh, gears the driving gear and the driven gear engages each other and as a result of that it pushes the oil outside or we get the outlet so that's how it works you can see the internal and the external gears mating each other and that's the gear which actually takes the drive uh, from the crankshaft and provides to the uh, internal or the uh, driving gear okay uh, for more technical videos please rate us and do subscribe to us uh, to motivate us and uh, we are also started a new project of uh, free technical assistance for projects and ideas to emerge so please read this and share with your friends because this might help uh, some of your uh, friends 